Amen. Ito, sirte mo lang talaga sa iyo. Denial. Hindi naman totoo. Dinadyar ko. 
Yun, doon na mapapasok yun. Ba, ano ba naman kakasuhan sa'yo? School paper ka. Nakilis lang kami ng, nakulis lang kami ng kalsada. Ayun yung ginabiyo mo, nilagay school paper mo. Who will charge you? Ba, that's your freedom of expression. Okay, any more? Sige, hindi ka dito. Okay, let's get it. How does this school paper help promote student journalism and writing skills? Same way. Journalism, you're starting a journalism career by having your own school paper. Diba? Pag nakapaglabas ka si school paper, in every month or every edition, meron kang article, that's now making you a journalist. Baka madiscover ka pa niya no. Madam Dabi na. Madiscover ka na ABS-CBN. Why? This one, the article is good. Look for that guy. I-hire natin niya. Bigyan natin 100,000 na mga kya. Tandaan niyo? Kasi ma-expose ka na eh. Nakikita yung mga publications mo, yung articles mo, out of this world, na nakakatulong sa community, somebody will hire you. Any more? The OVP angels, na sila ano, alam nyo, may kanya-kanya katangian na mga yan. Si Madam Jenna Marquez is a structural engineer. At in the... Madam Jella, yan, structural engineer yan. Si Joy, April Joy Dinaga. April Joy, well, like I told you, how to make content, papaturo tayo sa kanya. Okay. Ito maganda. Ito. Pag nabukuyo na yung paper ninyo, yung officers ninyo, magawa tayo ng website kay Joyce. Ayan o. O Joyce. Ayan. O di meron na kagad kayong sarili online na school paper. Bigyan nyo lang lahat ng contents kay Joyce. And she will do it. Siya na mag-aayos. Mayroon pa yung website reporting. Actual. Online pa. Diba? Magiging digital siya. Kaya lang mas gusto ko maglalabas kayo ng print material. Yun yung first vision natin. Kasi yung digital, madali lang. Yung hard copy mo, picture lang ni Joyce yun, isa by page by page. Lalabas sa website. Digital na kagal. Yung sarili niya. Okay. You try to make your article. Yung sarili mo, sarili yung gawa mo. Huwag ka mga mga I believe that's the best way to start. But later on, you will realize that you feel like it. Kasi lahat na nung nasa isip ko, sinasabi ng artificial intelligence. Diba? But I am not trying to encourage you. Limit at ba? You might go, hindi ko ba mapapractice yung ating mind to say and write and write What I am thinking, I am. But AI na itutulungan ka lang niya sa mas madaling paraan. Kami na, sa meron na tayong isang. In mind, the first edition of St. Edustin School Paper. Ready na kayo, ha? Possibly walang kumukuha ng picture dyan. Imposible walang picture si Madam Adela dyan. Imposible walang picture si Madam Lucia dyan. Okay, mag-interview kayo. Kung anong secret ni Madam Lucia, bakit ka ka ngayon maganda pa rin siya? O, di ba? Tanungin mo siya. Sigurado sasagutin ka niya. Ngayon na ba, sir? Hindi, in assignment nila yun. That's their first job to make an article to be published on the first edition. 
My doctor is one month. I'm giving him four weeks to prepare. Magpaprint tayo ng first first school paper ng school. Get? May tanong pa? Sino ba? Gusto magtanong. Halika. Pang forward. How do you measure the, leader, the leadership or engagement with the school paper? Leadership kayo ang magtitisight mo. Di ba? Not me. Not even AR. Alam niyo kung sino ang magiging sa inyo. Di ba? Magtintig lang dito ng leader ninyo eh. Alam niyo na kung sino siya eh. Di ba? Diba? Now, to, to identify yung traits niya as a good leader, eh kayo nakakaalam nun. But first, to become a leader, I will tell you, meron kasi yung criteria to become a leader. Meron siyang sinusunod. Like in my work before, sa Unila, it's a big company, uh, every seminar, tinuturo sa amin yung P, L, O, and C. Alam niyo may sabihin na sa management, a leader must have and possess the following. He must know how to plan. He must know how to lead. He must know how to organize. And he must know how to control. But most of all, a good leader must know how to delegate. Yun yung secret. Dinilis yung terte. Seventy pep lang ako. Yung, yung, yung aking ano, mag na kong laundi. Putusan ko lang. Ganun yun. Kasi yung mga karakter speak natin, kanya kanya yan. Atin yun. Individual traits yun yun sa'yo yun. But tumayo pa rito, hindi ka naminig. You're a good leader in the first place. Ganun na yan. So dapat kilala mo pa. Eh pag may pinatayo ka rito, kung ano. Bahina. Ay, wala yun. Hindi pwede mag-represent ng school paper yun. Ganun. Diba? Kaya sisikita ko, maybe after two weeks, in the corporate work. That was 1998. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we focused on our individual careers. Ito siya nag-concentrate. At the same time, inihingi yung kanyang services ng Kapugasyon Norte. So, nandiyan lang siya for life. Ako naman, nasa life na. As you can see. I devoted my time most on the trainings. Not only religion, but like this, on this case, yes, that you're having right now, school paper pala. Nasabi sa akin yung Mama Dela. Sir, sa dami ng mga topic na binubuksan sa GC natin, baka mapunta ka for the home for the agent. You know why? Because yung grupo ko, yan yung grupo namin, yan, kikita yung uniform na yan, uh, that represents lingap ang kapwa. So, we adopted from the values, institutions, in the government, yung lingap ng PSWD, we adopted it in CIT, we call it OBP, Lingap Kapwa. It's the same services we're providing assistance to our indigenous children in the province. Yan na. So, to cut it short, ito pala ako, ala ko ano yung St. Agustin College. I was a product of St. Agustin. Kaya lang sa Bacolod. 
Ngayon din ako nag-umpisa ng mga values ni St. Augustine. And I think your, your school is focused on uh, uh, caregiving, madam? Uh, what? Caregiving. Caregiving and other related courses for you to be able to find your job in the future. Okay, first inquiry, unang tanong. School paper publications. Do you have any background or is this your first time to have a school paper? First time. First time. So, wala pa kayong idea kung paano mag-umpisa magkaroon ng school paper. I think you already have seen during your high school days. Nakita hindi lang kayo aware yung mga programs na ginagawa ng schools. That's part of it. Now, to have your own school paper, of course, ano bang nilalaman nito? Anong reverse requirement mo? To have it run. E empty ka, you don't know anything. Where will you start? Okay, first content to focus on create your own school paper logo. Yun ang mauna. Kasi yun ang makumpisa na may logo ka. Okay, tingnan yung mga uniforms ninyo may logo. Di ba? You can start with that. Kasi official na yan eh. And then later on, you just try to design something like that you represent the paper. See? Pwede rin ang paikutan niya na name of your paper. See, that's the first content. Next. Pag na ikaw ay naging isip ng school paper, kinakailangan dyan, meron kang How many types of publications are you going to have? You will be required, maybe perhaps, by our team, and our Mama Della, to request on how many publications are you going to make as a school paper. Will it be a monthly? Will it be a quarterly? So quarterly, that's good. That means when you say quarterly, you have to compile all your activities in three months' time. And in three months' time, ipunin yan at gumawa kayo ng article on its activities. Yun na yung content. Simple, simple lang. Kung nagbabasa kayo yan ng newspaper, eto headlines niya. Kahali. Ang una nyo activity is ng outreach program. Meron ba outreach program ang, ang school? Okay, that's, that's your headline. And then, capture me picture. Lagi mo ng caption. And that's your first report. Nakuha niya, school paper. Picture, caption, headlines. That's your first one. Ilan yung activities ninyo? Summarize. Tapos document ko lahat ang mga activities ninyo and you have your school paper. Now, now when, let's go to printing. Pag printing naman, iba yan sa newspaper. Ang newspaper is a tabloid, right? Malaki siya. Simple. Now, naman, mas malaki sa book. A4 size. A4 size is good enough for the school. Pwede na A4. Okay? So, ilang picture ang pwede magkasya sa A4? Ilang article ang pwede mong ilagay sa isang page? So, I'm now making you a picture of what's the content of your paper. Siyempre, hindi mawawala yung set of officers ng school. Yun ang iyong pangbungat palagi yun. You have your first page, so malaki mong page, name of your paper, and then inside, You tawag doon, the first inside, front inside cover are your officers. And then third mo, except you may greetings ka. Dali lang yun. Picture ni Mahalda mo siya. Lagyan mo, ilagay mo yung kanya mga information stuff. And make an article for her. That's your third page. 
Taylor Court Page is Ma'am Adela, or maybe the school administration itself. Ano pala, naalala ko. I talked with Madam B. And uh, we're talking about an additional course. Additional <laughs> course for safety, I guess, the theological class. That will be given free to the students. Well, I know, uh, maybe sometime uh, you will be going to, uh, we will be giving schedule on moral values, the dogmas of whatever religion you have. Hindi naman siya straightforward yung teachings ng life where I belong. But it's a universal religion. Everybody reads the Bible. O kung ano ka, Muslim ka, we can discuss the principles, the dogmas of the Torah. See, ganun. Like, sa masonry, alam niyo sa masonry, sabi nila, ay, secret organization niya. It is not. Because in our altar, we have an open Bible and an open Koran. Kaya, Koran. Ganun yun. Kaya, in life, dapat ganun ka rin. Huwag mong sinabi, kung saan ako nagiging, hindi na mong mamamatay. Don't do that. Dapat flexible ka. Malay. Diba? Marami na, marami na. Marami na nagbago sa aking panahon. Diba? Ah, sabi natin nung mula elementary, tayo, December 25 is the birth of Jesus Christ. Pero ngayon, ang mga bagong pari, naniniwala sila na hindi pala December 25 Birthday. of that, when I got my approval from the school admin, by that time, na pwede na ako magturo. Okay, next. Bringing you back to the school paper, nasa fourth page na tayo, right? Nasa fourth page na. Yung susunod na pages na ay yung mga nakuha na ninyo mga activities. So you, you better train on making articles, making write-ups. Ngayon, wala na hirap ang paggawa ng article. Bakit? Panahon na po ngayon ng A. Artificial. Pagka nagsulat ka sa AI ng religion, lalabas lahat about the religion. It's the same way now in school paper. Meron kayo activity? No, meron kayo activity? Ano activity ninyo? Sulat mo lang sa AI and the article will follow about that. So there's no more difficulty in having your targets. School paper. Ano ba? Okay. Nasa loob na tayo ng school paper nyo. So, if you want it to grow more, you can solicit for somebody to sponsor your school paper so that you can have it printed in, well, a uh, uh, presentable manner, like color, uh, glossy. Marami na rin printed na yun that can provide you such as that. Nandito yung team ko, o meron tayo rin itong artist. Nandiyan si, si Joy. Artist siya on web design, artist siya sa layout. Kaya yung trabaho ko sa CIT Grand Reunion, napakadali. Ganun ito lang siya yung pag-imilis. O maya-maya ko nandiyan na. Ganun po kabilis ang OBP. Now, in your school paper now, so, konti lang ang kailangan ng panahon. Everything is provided. May question ka, you have your AI that you solve everything. Okay, kumuha nyo? Basta, eh lang ngayong panahon naman, lahat na may cellphone, di ba? Sa cellphone mo lang, makikita mo na eh. You can make your article even without your thinking na nag-iisip ng artikel. Lalo pa sa kalapas siya. Google mo lang yun eh. Di ba? Sakali, Google mo uh, nursing services. 
Gusto ko maging empleyado ako ng isang nursing uh, hospital. Sunday, na magamit ko yung aking pinagyara na sa St. Tegusti. Search mo lang yun eh. Ibig yan And where do you want to apply? Lahat po yan yung pinapagawa ko sa inyo that is the start. Mag-research mo. Anong pa lang yung pinapahanap ko? Oh, anymore? Yan, yeah, nangigya lang siya. Sige, sanayin natin ang ating mga sarili. What is the purpose of this paper? Purpose of the paper? Purpose of the paper? <laughs> What is the purpose? Okay, bakit ka gumagawa ng school paper? For everybody in the community to know what you have been doing, ano yung mga ginagawa ninyo, kaya ka nang i-create ng paper para itong information. These are the things we have been doing at St. Tegos P, you know, announcement. So a school paper is also an announcement. The activities of the school. Nakuha niyo? Siguro dito, mag-propose ako ng public speaking yeah. course. Okay, we'll be back. <laughs> Para mawala yung inyong mga takot. Next question! Ayan yan. Christian. Christian, you can go for this. So you can be heard. Okay, gusto mo? Okay, sige. How can a school paper raise awareness about important issues facing the student body? Very <laughs> good question. Pwede ilagay mo sa artikel mo. Di ba? Nakali. Uh, students awareness. Uh, how to make every, uh, make the students be aware of what They have been doing author, Christian. What's the content? Get it from the Google. Oh, may problema kayo. <laughs> See? Walang kahirap-kahirap. Diba? Awareness ang sinabi niya. Hanapin mo ulit yung awareness sa Google. Lalabas yung content and that's your article. You have become the author in an instant. Oh, do you want Okay. Another question. Next question. Pero pa? Ay, iya sila. Sige, next week, pagbalik ko. Oh, meron daw doon. Sige, come. Pick up. Come forward. Sir, as um, what you mentioned po earlier, that um, nowadays we are um, living in a world of AI, would you encourage us po to use AI or um, our own um, work? Because um, kasi po pag um, nagamit kami ng AI, is it, um, is it a cause of plagiarism po, sir? Plagiarism? No. AI allows you that. Kaya ang artificial intelligence eh. It's only to support what's in your mind. You can, actually you can compose your own. Your own composition, okay. But for you to make your job easier, do it. And then you edit it. You edit mo siya. Kung ayaw mo yung sinasabi niya, you can edit it. Diba? Ang sabi din ng kapatid ko from Toronto, he's already a priest. Sabi niya, if I'm going to make AI, then para hindi mo yung salita. Sabi niya. But check your thoughts. Ang lahat na nilalaman ng thoughts mo, sinasabi ng AI eh. Now, if you don't want that, you can edit. Ibigay niyo gusto mong word na gusto niyang lumabas. And the word ng plagiarism is, ang plagiarism is only allowed sa mga book articles na nakalagay 
Sabi niya, this is my own idea. I am the author of this. Bakit? Kung ikaw ba ay mamamopya? Word for word, pati koma, pakapakihin mo? Of course, you have to magnify it. Nakita niyo yun? So there's no plagiarism. There's no plagiarism. Ano ba naman ang mundo? Di ba lahat ng mundo, inirang naman natin lahat? Di ba? Wala naman dito yung sarili niya. Di yung sarili niya. Okay. If you try to make your own article, yung sarili mo, sarili yung gawa mo, huwag ka mang mangupya. I believe that's the best way to start. But later on, you will realize what you feel lang yan. Kasi lahat nang nasa isip ko, sinasabi ng artificial intelligence. Diba? But I'm not trying to encourage you. Ano? Limit that back. You might go, hindi ko ba mapapractice yung aking mind to say and write what I am thinking. Kaya. But AI na eh, tuturuhan ka lang niya sa mas madali. Kami na, sa meron na tayo isang in mind, the first edition of St. Adustine School Paper. Ready na kayo, ha? Possibly walang kumukuha ng picture dyan. Imposible walang picture si Madam Adela dyan. Imposible walang picture si Madam Lucia dyan. Okay, mag-interview kayo. Kung anong secret ni Madam Lucia, bakit ang ngayon maganda pa rin siya? O, di ba? Tanungin mo siya. Sigurado sasagutin ka niya. Ngayon na ba, sir? Hindi, yung assignment nila yun. That's their first job to make an article to be published on the first edition. My doctor is one man. I'm giving you four weeks to prepare. Pagpaprint tayo ng first first school paper ng school. Get? May tanong pa? Sino ba? Gusto mo tanong. Halika. Pang forward. Leadership or engagement with the school paper? Measurement. Measurement. Leadership, kayo ang mag-de-decide mo. Not me. Not even AI. Alam mo yung kung sito ang mag-limit sa inyo. Diba? Pag-tintig lang dito ng leader ninyo eh. Alam mo na kung sito siya eh. Diba? Diba? Now to to identify yung traits niya as a good leader, ay kayo nakakaalang nun. But first, to become a leader, I will tell you, meron kasi yung criteria to become a leader. Meron siyang sinusunod. Like in my work before, sa Unila, it's a big company, every seminar, tinuturo sa amin yung P, L, O and C. Alam niyo ang sabihin na sa management, a leader must have and possess the following. He must know how to plan. He must know how to lead. He must know how to organize. And he must know how to control. But most of all, a good leader must know how to delegate. Yan yung secret. Dinisip ko kerti. Seventy pep lang ako. Yung aking ano, mag na kong laundi. Putusan ko lang. Ganon yun. Kasi, yung mga karakteristik natin, kanya-kanya yan. 
atin yun, individual traits yun yun sa'yo yun. But tumayo ka rito, hindi ka naminig. You're a good leader in the first place. Ganun na yan, so dapat kilala mo pa agad. Eh pagka may pinatayo ka rito, ano? Mahina. Mahina. Ay, malayo. Hindi pwede mag-represent na school paper yun ganun. Diba? Kaya sisikita ko, maybe after two weeks, 